So, let's prepare another seafood recipe. This is fish fillet with tofu. Perfect ngayon darating na Holy Week or simply kung namimiss mo na ang iyong paboritong fish fillet dish na ino-order sa mga Chinese restaurant. So, nag-deep fry na ako dito ng tofu and I have here the fish fillet. I'm using bangus because ito yung meron ako sa ref and masarap naman talaga siya. So, this is the bangus. Actually, parang daing na bangus to. And then, I cut it into smaller pieces. And what I'm doing here, coat mo lang with flour and you deep fry it. No? So, kahit anong fish, pwede. Huwag ka lang gumamit ng mga masyadong flavorful, katulad ng salmon. Kasi mag maglalaban-laban naman yung flavor. Bangus is nice for this dish. No? So, i-deep fry mo muna yan, the bangus, and then the tofu, until golden brown. So, tatapusin kong prituhin tong acting bangus. Okay, so, this is golden brown. Set it aside. So, may nagtanong minsan, can I reuse the oil? Of course, yes. You can reuse the oil. So, katulad nito, you see, it's cloudy now because there is flour. We coated the bangus with flour. Pero habang lumalamig yung mantika, magsesettle down sa ilalim yung mga traces of flour. So, lilinaw ulit yan. So, you can reuse it, of course. And then, I, I've heated my, my pan, my skillet. Lalagyan ko lang ng konting mantika. This is a stir-fried dish. So, napakabilis gawin. So, painitin mo lang yung kawali mo. Okay, painitin mo. You can also use a wok. I'm just using this kasi gusto ko may kulay. O, di ba? Para maganda sa video. High flame. Put it on high flame, over high flame. And then, you saute first the garlic. Nagay mo yung bawang mo. The onions. Baka sabihin nyo, nangingilo kayo. Kung nagpapalit ako, I'm using a wooden spoon. Para mas, o, diba? Mas smooth pakinggan. The ginger. And maglalagay din ako ng black beans or tausi. This will give your dish a very nice flavor and aroma. O, ayan, naamoy ko, di ba? Hindi ko nilalagyan ng salt to because the tausi is salted black beans para naman hindi ma-overpower yung... hindi overpowering yung uh, alat. And then, this is shiitake mushrooms. Isa mo lang. Napakabilis po nito. And then, you put brown sugar. One to two tablespoons. I start with one tablespoon. Konting black vinegar. The black vinegar is optional. Pero ang kagandahan kasi dito is binabalance niya. Nakakaroon ng acidity. Just a splash of black vinegar. Kung ayaw mo maglagay, it's fine. Okay, and then this is bell peppers. And yung sauce natin. So for the sauce, I have your soy sauce. Meron ako ditong toyo. Just ordinary soy sauce. Water, pagsamahin mo. And cornstarch. So basically, you're, you're preparing a slurry. So i-mix mo muna sila together. You dissolve the cornstarch first. And then you pour it in there. As simple as that. Pakuluin mo. Let the sauce thicken. O, 
di ba? Kung ayaw mo nga ng fish fillet, pwedeng chicken ang gamitin mo, pwedeng pork, or pwedeng tokwa lang kung gusto mo talagang plant-based. This is uh, spring onions, and titikman ko po if I needed to add more sugar. Lagay ko na yung 2 tablespoons kasi gusto ko medyo on the sweet side. And then now, I can now turn off or pwede ko nang hinaan ng konti yung apoy. Put some black pepper. And then, ilagay na natin yung ating mga pinirito na tokwa and fish. I'll, I'll be needing the help of this one para mas mabilis ko siyang matas. O, diba? Ganun lang po kasimple. Restaurant style. O, ngayon, patayin mo na yung apoy para hindi naman masyadong mag-dry. So, this is now your fish fillet with tofu. And then, you put this is good sesame oil. Sa dulo mo, ilagay. So, let's get some rice. And this is your fish fillet with tofu. O, oh, diba? Let's try it. Mmm. Mmm. Perfect. Nandun yung sweetness, pero hindi niya na-overpower yung yung flavor ng tausi, black vinegar ng soy sauce. Maganda yung nandyan siya, pero hindi ka na-overpower. Diba? Nagko-complement, nagbabalance. Mmm. And nandun pa din yung crunch nung bangus. So, gumawa ka na. You know, masarap din to if you're going to use squid. Pwede ka din gumamit ng hipon. Ayan tuloy, sorry. Kasi natatak na. Na-excite akong ubusin siya. And of course, on the side, you can put chili sauce, kalamansi, di ba? Or kung anong type mong ilagay. And you know, ngayon ko lang naisip, perfect din to, di ba? Kung sa pansit lang. Kung ayaw mo ng rice, pwede siyang pang kanton. So, meron kang kanton and then, lagay mo yan sa ibabaw or simply crispy noodles. O, di ba? So, ang dami mong ideas na pwedeng gawin using this one simple recipe. So, happy cooking and take care.